this is enough to be away for the amount of time that I'm going to be away. And oops. Hey, this is your girl, Alicia D, a.k.a. Egyptian, and say Tony Visual Media, that's me. I'm here with you with another episode of A Journey Come True, where dream, dream chasers go to explore all the things they love to do. And my hopes is to inspire you to do the things that you love to do as well. So, today I am packing. Oh, did I tell you? I, I think I told you. Don't tell nobody, okay? So, um, I'm packing, right? And I am having a challenging time because I'm going to be gone for almost like two, maybe three months. And though this could be a carry-on, I want to take it on as my personal. <laughs> it's that bad pretty bad and I have one other suitcase that's just a little bit taller than this one that I wanted to put my clothes in so the things that I'm putting in here are like like my um, arts and crafts and my camera equipment and um, my toiletries and then my other suitcase will have my underclothes my regular clothes um, socks you know things of that nature but I am so baffled because I don't know if they'll allow me to carry this on as a personal because I don't know if this will slide underneath my seat and it probably won't, right? When in doubt, leave it out. So I'm having issues in trying to figure this out because I have a lot that I want to take with me. But it's not a lot. Like, I have my clothes, but then, and it's not even a want. Like, I even have a bag. Of, oops. I have a bag. I have a bag of toiletries, you know, just like off and um, soaps and hand, not hand sanitizer, but um, what is that? Um, what is it? You guys know. Sunscreen. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, sunscreen. So I have that. And I, I have a big bag of stuff that I think is imperative to have while I'm over there. Um, I'm going to show you what I have in a moment. I just dropped my post. Sorry. Let's leave this post a second. Time is moving. It's 5.04 right now. Today is July 24th, and I leave on July 29th. So, this big old bag right here, can you see it? I'm trying not to take it all out, but this bag here, and it just pretty much has everything in it. You can see everything from here. So I slid that in, and it fits perfectly, right? It fits right in there. 
it's pretty perfect. So I just, I'm just gonna pack and however this turns out, that's how it turns out. Because if I have to pay a little extra to have two carry-ons, then I guess I'm gonna have to pay that little extra. So that, I'll, I'm gonna um, tune back in for, for you to see how I pack this. So stay tuned for that. And once I get to the airport, we'll see how that all goes. <laughs> all right. So I'm doing a quick tutorial. Well, it's not even a tutorial. I'm going to show you a quick um, video clip of how I packed for 30 days. Oh, um, disregard the sound effects in the background. So this is my carry-on, and my clothes. So I put everything in Ziploc bags and just literally squeezed the air out on my own, with my own strength, guys. I didn't use any vacuum or anything like that. Just all you need is heavy-duty Ziploc bags. So I have clothes in that bag. I have clothes in this one. That's shirts. Those are pants. These are bras. And I have literally two pair of shoes in here. Three pair of shoes in here, actually, because they're at the bottom. There's a pair there. And another pair right there. And I have a pair hanging on the back, which I'll probably wear. So I'll probably wear those. And yeah, that's what my bag looks like. And then I have my socks there. As you can see, I just stuck them in there. And then all of my toiletries are in this one little spot. Everything. And all of those are in a Ziploc bag. They have their individual bags, but I put them all in one big bag. So, disaster just struck. So, yeah, I just wanted to show you that. And at least if stuff falls out, it's not all your clothes touching the dirty ground or anything like that. It's all in plastic. All right, this is your girl, Lisha D, a.k.a. Egyptian, that's me, with another quick episode of A Journey Come True. Yes.